In one hour, this bomb will explode, and it will kill dozens, possibly hundreds of people. We need to find out where the bomb is, and the only person who knows this is the person whom the CIA has arrested. The ongoing debate about torture has been driven in part by that image, the image of the hypothetical prisoner who has planted a hypothetical bomb under hypothetical circumstances. But the debate about torture has also been driven by real images. In April of 2004, the national media got hold of photographs showing U.S. soldiers abusing prisoners at Abu Ghraib. You've all seen these photographs. One photograph showed a female soldier, Private Lindy England, dragging a naked prisoner by a leash. Americans should not shirk the responsibility, the uniquely democratic responsibility, of holding their leaders accountable for this betrayal. It would be a shame of historic proportions if Americans were to surrender this uniquely democratic right. Thank you. Um, I know that many um, people who have spoken out against um, the government and stuff have been sent threats. Have, have you ever been sent threats by the government or people telling you to stop speaking out against torture? I have never been threatened by the government for speaking out on these issues. Um, but you're right that there are a lot of people um, who feel that the government is targeting them because of their dissent. Um, and there's a lot, there is evidence of, of that in, in, I'll give you a couple examples. There are people who have been put on the no-fly list, um, this is the list that prevents you from getting on an airplane, um, who have clearly not done anything criminal, have not done anything wrong, or not suspicious on, for, on any ground, uh, except that they participate in uh, demonstrations against particular government policies. Uh, forums like this are extremely important. There are a lot of things that uh, people can do to change the policies um, that are violating international and domestic law. And uh, it's important that people speak out, let their representatives know that they care about these issues. Uh, there are ways you can do that. Uh, the ACLU has a number of different action proposals on its website. Other organizations have action proposals on their website. You can write to your representative. You can come to the ACLU's Day of Action on June 26th in D.C. Uh, there are a number of things that people can do uh, to make sure that their voices are heard and to make sure that these policies are changed.